Hello to everyone, this is Adventure Story and today I have a very very important video for you with photos and we will talk about them each photo we will talk separately okay first of all I like to thank you for everybody to watch my videos and stay tuned and connected to our channel first of all today we will speak about auxiliary boiler cleaning and inspection inside okay first of all you need to cool down your boiler okay you need to set your boiler at lower pressure and this how you can achieve this you will not start your boiler and easy easy you will depressurize until the pressure will be zero okay but this will take some hours maybe one two days okay because the boiler the metal inside the water is very hot and have big thermal quantity okay the quantity of water also is a lot and you think about one two days okay as i said also in one point when the boiler is about one bar or one and a half bar you need to open the vent valve so the boiler will depressurize okay very good practice is to clean the boiler every six months to make wash inside the wall of the tubes okay because after combustion they became dirty as you can see here this is the tube inside the boiler from inside it's passing the water and outside the fire the burning fire okay from the burner it's cover this tube and inside the water start to boil that's how it's produced the steam this is the wall of tube this is what is inside the boiler the furnace and this all needs cleaning because if you do not clean for a long time the transfer of the thermal transfer will be lower and your boiler capacity will be reduced okay and some tubes if they are dirty they can be overheated inside they can be a damage if you don't keep your boiler clean okay in this picture we can see in the middle the burner this is the main burner and here is uh, the pilot okay the pilot starts from the beginning for the start of the flame okay starts a small flame with diesel okay the diesel is ignited by uh, spark okay 15,000 volt spark ignites the diesel and small flame appears the pilot lowered down and then the main burner okay which is in the middle injects the fuel okay the fuel oil or diesel it depends what condition working and then one big flame starts about three four meters long maybe more and cover all the burner okay and the walls transmit the thermal heat which is inside the exhaust gas passing in this every average temperature and heat transfer through this pipe okay when you make washing with high pressure machine okay you need to open one drain which is going to stop collecting time this drain is at the back of the boiler most of the boilers and you need to monitor so the drain is working and it's free to not block and water coming down okay this is gas from the burn there are different tubes as you can see this is the exhaust pipe you can see the steam tubes these tubes they have like this steam which what the main reason of this steam after the exhaust gas 
travel inside it's like trap we relax the exhaust gas to move slower and give all the thermal power that have and transfer to the heat setting this is like slower okay exhaust and the washing here take place this can be fixed after washing okay they are clear as you can see everything is clear no any remaining only metal surface remains it's really big inside you can stand with a ladder inside this is the door okay we rebuilt the door again because there was a little bit damage to the insulation and we rebuilt with uh, new thermal protection okay this is rebuilt we leave there until it dries and here also it's thermal insulation protection to the sides on the cover to be sure that there is no loss of thermal okay and fire will not come out this is a little about of washing okay most of the borders have inspection doors so where you can reach all the points and inspect thank you for watching this is adventure story bye bye